Jim, you've got the rule pulled up over there. So take us through exactly as the rule book reads. I mean, you have to slide into second base directly where your foot hits the ground first. You have to be able to reach the base, and you need to be able to hold on to the base after you've stopped. And, you know, by that rule, he, Hoskins, did everything there. The question was, even if it was late, you know, was he making contact after the base? He was, but he, he actually touched the ground first before he hit the base and then slid off, right, with his foot. But he was able to hold on at the end, and that's why I think when they reviewed it that it was not considered an illegal slide. Well, I think it was close. I, I think it was close because he slid to the side of the bag, and it was a little bit late. So his foot was about even with the bag by the time his hip and his, his leg hit the ground, which carried him through. And he had to, you know, make an effort to hold on to the bag to not slide past the bag. And I think the most valid thing that Jeff said there is it's, there's an in-between. There's an in-between. It's, it's hard to really know what is a clean slide, what is a not clean slide even within the boundaries of the rules what is a slide that's kind of dirty and maybe um, you know is something that's going out to uh, hurt a guy and in that particular case I do think Jeff was at least thinking about turning it because he, he lost the ball at transfer if he wasn't going to turn it at all he probably would have um, stretched out like a first baseman and gotten the, uh, the ball and come off the bag and not been in the area but I think it goes to the fact that what we said earlier which is second basemen feel like there's an invisible line there and they're protected by the back of the bag and so Jeff when he said he hit his back leg that's a shock Reese is a big guy he slid past the bag and that shock of getting your back leg taken out right. is probably why Jeff thought oh my god he's got to be past the bag this couldn't have been legal I, I agree exactly with you just said Todd you know there's there's going to be cer certain s situations where a guy who can really run Who's, who's coming into you, he's going to slide early, but his momentum's going to take him over the bag and still hang on to it, and you're going to get hit at second base. And they are right now. They're used to not being hit. And, and yeah, I, I think you can go back, and, and you're right. There's always that gray area. Hey, was that legal or was it not? I mean, we, saw, we had a play today uh, uh, when... Stewart got picked off at first base. They have the new rule. You can't block the bag. Well, if you look replay, it sure looked like that bag might have been blocked. So, you know, again, there's, you know, when, when they make new rules, and a lot of times, you know, they are, each, each umpire crew looks at it a different way once in a while. And so I, I think today, I'm just glad he didn't get hurt. I, yeah. You know, I know he got spiked. I, you and I both are filled with our legs are filled with scars about being spiked. I was more concerned with the left leg yeah. because uh, he, if he gets on top of that left leg, he can blow that knee and up. Listen, this was not a Chase Utley play, but the rules have changed because of the Utley play that you know quite well. Fairly well. Uh, yeah, very well. So, <laughs> so is there some uh, gray area here that, that players are confused by and about when it comes to standing in there in those situations? It's, Gary, without a question. Uh, you know, and, and I think, obviously, they reviewed the play. According to what Jim just read, it was a legal slide. Right. But we also had situations, remember, a few, when they changed the play at home plate? Yeah. Uh, where the catcher could be in home plate? You know, the umpires came to spring training and took us out on the field. Now, this was this umpire. But how do we know what the next cruise umpire is going to feel? You know, and that's where that's got to be somehow it's got to be etched in stone. Hey, this is what's going to happen here. But with the with the replay today, they said it was legal. So they're going to move on. But there's going to be times, Todd, and you, you, and you were right. You know, they're not used to being hit at second base. And there's going to be times that you're going to get dumped and it's going to shock you.